There's been a surprising wealth of camera technology on show at this year's CES, whether it's the new Android-powered offerings from Samsung and Polaroid, or updates to classic products by Nikon and Sony. We've seen plenty for photography buffs to get excited about. Here's our pick of the best. Nikon's big camera unveiling at CES was the D3300, a budget-friendly DSLR that offers most of the functionality of its more expensive cousins for half the price. With a launch price of £500, the camera has a 24.2 megapixel sensor that comes with its low-pass filter removed. This allows for less noise and more detail when you crop into shots. With Nikon's X-Speed 4 image processing system included too, this is one snapper we can't wait to get into our test labs. At 210 grams, the Sony Alpha 5000 is ultra lightweight and represents a significant improvement on the NEX 3N. Its 20.1 megapixel APS-C sensor and Bion's X processor are a nimble combination that allow for great image quality and a faster frame rate when taking photos. The Polaroid Socialmatic is a cute Android-powered device that allows you to print your snaps in less than a minute on heat-activated zinc paper. It has a 14 megapixel sensor for general shots and a 2 megapixel one for selfies that should appeal to both retro enthusiasts and young folk alike. Fed up with reflections on your camera's screen, then you'll appreciate the Panasonic TZ60's key feature, its viewfinder. Aside from this increasingly rare compact design point, the TZ60 has an 18.1 megapixel sensor and its lens can reach a wide angle of 24mm, all useful additions for capturing your holiday travels. Samsung's first crack at an Android-based camera was a bit hit and miss, so it's had another go with a Galaxy Camera 2. The benefit of featuring Android 4.3 Jelly Bean in a camera is that your shots are more easily shared using apps like Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. Aside from a new faux leather and brushed steel design though, the Galaxy Camera 2 is nearly identical to its predecessor. 